today are going to take a look at the 2021 AMC 10B Palm 11. Grandma has just finished baking a large rectangular pan of cookies. She's planning to make rectangular pieces of equal size, like this. And they're dividing it into a bunch of rectangles, essentially, is what they're doing. And they're dividing something like this, maybe, right? So, what is the greatest number of bounties that Grandma can produce? So, let's just see the dimensions are x by y. Oops, this should be y. So, we want to find the number of bounties that can be produced. So, notice that we're given this condition here. The number of pieces on the interior is the same as the perimeter. So, that means that, well, how many pieces are on the interior? This dimension right here is going to be x minus 2. This dimension right here is going to be y minus 2. And then this is going to be some kind of region here. So what is x minus 2, y minus 2? We want to like find out that region, right? So we know that x times y is going to be 2 times x minus 2 times y minus 2. Because if the region on the inside and the perimeter is equal, then the overall region is double the interior region, right? Because the area on the inside is a, pieces on the outside is a, and we know that 2a is, is going to be 2 times a the inside part, right? And then we simplify this, we get xy equals 2x. Let's expand that out. x, x minus, xy minus 2x minus 2y plus 4. And then from here we just see that xy will then be equal to 2xy minus 4x minus 4y plus 8. And then we see that xy minus 4x minus 4y plus 8 is 0. More than x minus 4 times y minus 4 is going to be equal to 8. And from here, what do we do? From here, we just look at the different factor pairs. These are the only two ones that are relevant. We see, in this case, we have x equals 5, y equals 13, right? Because, you know, it's just, well, sorry, x equals 5, y equals 12. And in this case, in this case, we have, and a good, in this case, we've got 6 and 8. And now the try to use which one is greatest, which one is larger, 5 times 12 or 6 times 8. 5 times 12 is 60, and 4, 6 times 8 is 48. So 60 has to be larger, and that has to be our answer. We want to find the greatest possible to make. And a good way to make sure, right, is check. So in 5 times 12, how many pieces would we have in the perimeter? We would have 5 pieces like this. We would have 5 pieces like this. We would have, tw we have, we would have, we would have 12 pieces on this side. 5 on this side, 12 on this side, and then we would have 4 corner pieces overcounted. So then we would have 30 pieces on the interior, on the exterior, and we would then have, in a 5 by 12 grid, we would have 3 times, we would have 30 pieces on the interior, and then 30 pieces on the interior as well, because it would just be 3 times 10, which is 30. Check its work, we see 60 has to be the correct answer. Thank you all for watching this video, and I hope to see you next time. Bye!